Welcome to technical drawing. Today we are going to see this seven oblique. See, we have front view, side view. So first we will draw layout. See, length is how much and height is how much. Height is one one five, and length is one twenty. Then if you see origin is here, right hand side. How much is the width? Sixty. So we'll draw box like this. After drawing this. This is inclined at forty-five degree. Okay. Now, if you see in this, how many parts are there? One, two, and three. Here, how many parts? One, two, three, four. So we'll start with three. And if you see this part one is huge. It's here. It's nearer to the observer, right? With this semicircle. So we'll draw that first. So I'll take thirty, thirty. See how much is this? Thirty. Then go down by thirty, and you draw circle, semicircle, and you draw circle diameter thirty. After that, from here, you go down. That you can calculate, and then you join this with this corner. Same way here. Find out the center point for the circle, and you draw a line like this. Now see how much is this? Fifteen. So that slope you can draw, and you can join part two. This is part two. How much it is behind? Forty-five. So I can take this forty-five behind. This will also go inside. See, this part is done. This part is done. Now, this circle is behind also. So from this point, I'll go behind. How much I have to go behind? Sixty. And I'll draw curve. Same radius and tangent. So if there is nothing, then it will be like this. But if you see, there were rib inclined portion, so that you join. Sorry. How much is the width? Ten. So you take ten and you draw parallel line. Again, you draw. Take this radius. Fifty. You go behind by fifty. Why? Because sixty minus ten fifty, and again you draw this curve. This curve will come, go down, and draw horizontal line. So this is how you get this part, inclined portion. So I hope you people have understood this sum. Thank you.